Let your customers enjoy the ease and convenience of a contactless order and pay experience from their own phones. Sapod Direct is a QR code based contactless ordering solution designed exclusively for restaurants. In this video, we'll help you set up your Sapod Direct store and create QR codes in just a few simple steps. To start, let's configure your Sapod Direct store. Log into your Sapod account with your credentials. Visit Setup, Sapod Add ons, then Sapod Direct. Go to the Primary Settings tab. Click on Primary Brand Color and pick a color from the palette to match your brand identity. Now, go to Company Logo and click Plus Add Logo to upload your logo image. Enable Accept Tips if you want to accept tips from customers for dine-in orders. For enabling email OTPs, check out our video on Enable OTP via email for Sapod Direct on our Sapod Academy channel. Next, go to Domain Name and type in the URL for your store. You can leave the field empty if you do not have a domain. Click Save. Next, let's set up payments. Click on the Payment Types tab while you're in Sapod Direct Settings. Go to the Pay at Counter tab. Click Enable to activate counter payments or pay upon order mode. This payment mode will be used for walk-in orders. If you wish to accept online debit or credit card payments from your customers, you will need to take an account with a payment gateway in your country. Sapod Direct supports the following payment gateways. Stripe, Paytabs, MyFutura, iPay88, PayU, and more. For contact information of payment gateway representatives in your region, please get in touch with support at sapod.com. Once you have your payment gateway, select the appropriate payment gateway tab. Tick the enable box. Key in all the details, including publishable key and secret key. These are unique identifier codes that are provided by your payment gateway. Click Save. That's great. Let's move on to create a general announcement. With Sapod Direct, you can easily display non-marketing messages on your digital store. For example, if you want to inform your customers that your restaurant will be closed for a special event tonight, to create a general announcement, click on the Announcement tab here at Sapod Direct Settings. Type in your announcement in the General Announcement box. We'll be closing at 9 p.m. tonight due to a private event. And click Save. Now, your Sapod Direct customers will know of the event beforehand and set plans accordingly. Now, let's set up your menu. You can select specific food items from your main menu for your Sapod Direct store. Easily set up your menu with just a few clicks. Let's go back to Setup, then Location Setup. Click on the appropriate location for your Sapod Direct store. Go to Self-Ordering Systems, then Sapod Direct. Click on the Menu tab. You can either click on the category to get to your menu item, or type in your menu item in the search dish box. By clicking on the availability box, you choose which items will appear in your Sapod Direct store menu. When you've completed this category, click on Save Category and move on to the next until you've picked all food items for your Sapod Direct store menu. Make sure to add images and descriptions for each menu item. Remember to click Save after every category. That's wonderful! Now we can promote our menu. Let's add marketing announcements and advertisements. Introducing a new menu item or a special offer? Promote it with a beautiful banner displayed across the top of your customer screens. When a customer clicks it, it goes directly to the item or category. It's a great way to attract attention and drive sales. With Sapod Direct, you can also easily post special offers and promotions through marketing announcement. To add advertisements and marketing announcements, go to the Marketing tab. Type in your marketing announcement here. Let's say, get 10% off on signature pizzas every Wednesday. To place advertisements, click plus add to upload your ad image. Ad images must be 650 by 500 pixels and formats at JPEG or PNG. You can create up to three eye-catching banner ads. 
If you want to link a specific food item or category to your advertisement, click item or category from the dropdown and search for the specific item or category you'd like to attach to the ad. Then click save. Customers will be taken to the selected link when they tap on your ad. Now that you've completed the initial setup for Sapa Direct, you're ready to set up QR codes for your store. Generating a QR code for your menu is the first step to creating a beautiful self-ordering experience for your guests. Let your customers scan the QR code to browse your digital menu on their phones. No app downloads. They can order and pay in just a few taps. To generate a restaurant QR code for your QSR, just click on the Generate QR button here. If you have table service, go to the Table QRs tab, select the Dining section, and click a table's Generate QR button to create QR codes for specific tables. You can also create QR codes for all of your tables at once by clicking Generate QR for All Tables. All right, you can now download and print the QR code and display it in strategic areas and tables at your outlet for your customers to scan and place orders. Note that tables assigned with a specific QR code will only take online debit or credit card payments. Make sure that you've enabled at least one payment gateway. And there you have it. You've set up your Sawpod Direct in just a few easy steps. Configure your Sawpod Direct store. Set up payment. Create a general announcement. Set up your Sawpod Direct menu. Add marketing announcements and advertisements. Set up your QR codes. Access all these features exclusively with Sawpod Direct Pro for only $29.99 USD a month for each location. Want to learn more? Click on the link below to book a demo.